It's only a matter of time before my minions come to rescue me. <laughs> Don't count on it, Sonny. You must never squeeze a squirrel into a tight hat. And now, history. In today's lesson, we shall be studying some of the great heroes of Oddsburg. Yes! Heinrich von Limpet, bronze medalist at the 1812 Turnip Tossing Championships. Uh, hmm. oh. Manfred Klinker, who saved the town from flooding by sticking his head in the hole when the dam burst. Fritz Beetlebaum, the first man in Oldsburg ever to wrestle a grizzly bear with one hand. Why did the grizzly bear only have one hand? Beetlebaum, what a guy! Oh, indeed, Pipsquawk, all of them very great men. But what about all the very great women? <gasps> there must be some female heroes. Who ever heard of a hero who was a girl? The big boy's big book of big boy stuff says all the heroes in the world ever were boys! Like it by Kubik. I like girls. <laughs> no, no, I don't. I like biscuits. When he when 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 is school gonna finish? <laughs> she looks like a nice old lady. Maybe if I help her, she'll be my friend. Good afternoon, Mrs. Old Lady. I wonder if I could be of any um. <laughs> Why does everyone do that when they see me? Come on, lads. Let's go and read what the mighty masked muscle is up to this week. Lottie, my oh. bestest friend. I've really, really, really this missed boys you. boys make my blood boil. Yeah, I'll get that sometimes. Usually when Dr Frankenstein wires me up to the generator. Headed. Yeah, I'll get that sometimes too. Usually when Dr. Frankenstein gives me a pig's head. <laughs> I'll show them. There must have been some heroes in Oddsburg who were girls. Am I using the wrong deodorant or what? <laughs> Biff, zap, kapow! Go for it, mighty boss muscle. Hiya! Boof, snicked. That's it. Everybody loves a superhero. It is time I embraced my destiny. <laughs> oh, it's no good, Brunhilde. I cannot reach it. But my keys down there, Heinrich. However, will I be able to unlock the padlock on my goat? This is a job for Fantastic Captain Bad, Bad, Bad. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> It's frightful! It's fearsome! Ta-da! There you go, Mrs. Lady Woman! It's fantastic! You are a hero, fantastic Captain Bat! Have some freshly baked hey. cheesecake! I think I'm gonna like people liking me for a change. Curse 
Please, you have discovered my secret identity, Titi. Fine, what are you doing? This is not Sarama. No, it's Fantasticola. Everybody loves me now. And you get pickled herrings. But if the villagers find out, they'll turn against you. You know how turn against you they can be. No way, Lottie. I'm the best thing that's happened to Osberg since sliced gherkin schnitzel. Fine, Nine. You go and play hero. But by tomorrow, everyone will have forgotten Fantastic Captain Bat. <laughs> OK! OK! Osberg has a superhero. He's daring and dashing, and everybody loves him. Especially me. I think he's really cool. Huh? Has everyone gone Captain Batty bonkers? Look, Lottie, I got you a new duvet cover. Uh... I don't believe this. Don't get in the flap. The bat is back. Oh, I was wondering, most superheroes have a superhero sidekick to help them be heroic. And? Can I be yours? I've already got a costume. Look! Ta-da! It's Caved Cardboard Box Girl. She's daring. She's dynamic. She's... A girl. Nice try, loser. But why would he want a sissy sidekick when he could have manly, manly, manly man? <laughs> More like an annoying boy. Yeah! Spinko! <laughs> Splatting! Kids, kids, fantastic Captain Bat doesn't share the spotlight. I work alone. It is my destiny. Ah, oh, come on. I'd be awesome. I'm sorry, Sonny. This is no job for little uns. Away! Wait, fantastic Captain Bat! More like Captain Fathead. Who does he think he is? Maybe time to clip his wings forever. <laughs> Thank you, fantastic Captain Bat, for getting that paving stone off my foot. I have one of my tasty turnip and garlic pasties. Uh, yeah! No thanks, Mrs. Old Lady. I can't stand garlic. Gotcha! Huh? Here you go, Mrs. Lottie's mum, with love from fantastic Captain Bat. Oh, my hero! Ah, here comes my grateful fan club with even more yummy cakes! There is the so-called superhero, but I have proof he's something very different indeed. Different? Don't be so ridiculous! Let us consider the evidence. Fact one, he has an obvious oh. fang. Well, that's true enough. He is pretty fangy. Fact two, he looks like a bat. He is very bat-like. Fact three, he hates garlic. He turned his nose up at my pasty. Remind you of anything? Is. My auntie Gla He's a vampire! A vampire! A vampire! Guys, you've got the wrong end of the steak! It's me, good old Betty! Your buddy, your pal! Where is the vampire? Ah! So fantastic now, Captain Bat, or should I say, Vampire Bat? <gasps> Lottie! Lottie! You? But that's not possible! Congratulations, Pipsquawk! You've discovered the secret identity of Fantastic Captain Bat! Oh, our, our hero, hero was, was a girl! girl. Oh. I still like biscuits. It's all right, folks, there was no vampire. Just a brave little girl who was trying to help her village. Well, it looks like Oddsburg got its first female hero after all. Thanks for saving me, Lottie. It was nice being popular for a while, but having you as my best friend is the bestest. Nine. <laughs> <laughs>
intergalactic time capsule, we're here to play a unique game where knowing the answers is not the only thing you need to win. In this game, it pays to hold out and answering a question if you want to get maximum points. And that's something you do want to do, otherwise you'll end up in this, the goo portal. Let's get a little bit more stuff in there. Oh, thank you. Now, as it's a game show, we need plenty of questions, and our computer is chock-a-block full of them. He is the total intelligence mechanism, or as I like to call him, Tim. Tim, how are you doing? When Earth's top scientists invented me, I don't think they had a quiz show in mind. Stop moaning. Now, there are three rounds and only one place in the final where one contestant will be competing for a star prize. So, you know the rules? Let's find out who's playing today. And our first player is Jack. Hiya, Jack. Hello. How are you doing? Fine. Excited about being here with us on Wait yeah. For It? Yeah. Yeah? What are you most nervous about? Nothing. Nothing? This is a confident fella. I like it. Not even walking out there to the drop zone and no. the goo portal? No. Wow, this guy is unshakable. Well, it's nice to see you, Jack. Let's meet our second contestant. This is Katie. Hello, Katie. Hi. How are you doing? I'm great. This is a great outfit you've got going on. <laughs> I like it. Now, I understand that you, you speak a couple of languages. Yeah. What, what can you speak? Um, I can speak French and I can speak a little bit of Spanish. Do you want to give us a blast or something? What would you rather speak? French. Go on, give us something in French. Bonjour et au revoir. All right. Oh. <laughs> Hello, goodbye. Very good. Fantastic. OK. Well, uh, nice to meet you, Katie. Thank OK. You. Let's go and meet uh, player three, who is Adam. Hiya, Adam. Hello. How's it going? Fine. I think that the T-shirt is a good match with the goo portal. <laughs> what do you reckon? Uh, yeah. What are you most nervous about playing Wait For It today? Stand on the edge of that and make that fall and be falling in there. Oh, it's not too bad, you know. <laughs> you might even enjoy it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, nice to meet you, Adam. Nice Thank to see you. you. Our fourth player is Erin. Hiya, Erin. Hi. I hear you're a good swimmer. Is that right? Yeah. That's something that could come in handy if you make that drop. And you're a bit of a dancer as well. What sort of dancing do you like? Um, my favourite, hip-hop. Hip-hop? Bit of a hip-hop till you don't stop. I can do some body. Look at that, eh? How about those? <laughs> Charming. <laughs> Contain yourself, Erin, all right? <laughs> You're hurting my feelings now. All right, well, it's really nice to meet you. Pull yourself together, cos we're about to play round number one. <laughs> 